Hello, this is Chris Menard, Great News, Microsoft Outlook, which a lot of us are users. They've changed the way search works and they've moved it. I'm on my inbox on the desktop version. Search used to be located around here. It is now up top in the title bar. When you click here, some of the changes they made is it now has um, intelligence. It'll start doing spelling suggestions. It'll also do search suggestions. It's rel more reliable, and most importantly, it's faster. So if I start typing in ART, it found Art Vandalay, but it also found Articulate. If I just keep on typing, not only did it find emails from Art Vandalay, because it's trying to prompt me for that here, it even found meetings that I have with them. But I'm going to go ahead and click this one time. In the bottom left-hand corner is 24. Just in case you're wondering, I have over 35,000 emails. I've got uh, approximately 5 to 6 gigs of Outlook data. So it's really fast. I can also come back up here. I want to point out that in the search box, the arrow is pointing down. So when I click this one time, the arrow points up and it's almost like a Gmail fill. Gmail search has always been great. Attachments from receive subject. Attachments, yeah, I only want to see attachments from Art Vandalay. 24 again in the bottom left when I click yes. Oh, got to click search. I'm down to three. So it's working and it's really fast again. If you want to clear the search, I'm going to hit the X to clear it. Watch this next one. I'm going to click in the search box. I'm going to hit the triangle pointing down. I can't remember who sent me the email. I can't remember a lot about it, but I know it was an attachment. And I know the attachment had KitKat in it. There it is. There's the email. It's an attachment. There's definitely two attachments. If I select one of them, the preview feature and Alec will work. And look, A11 says KitKat. So that worked. Clear the search again. Go back to it. You can also change when you click here. So if you know it's from somebody specifically, you can do that. You can do when you received it. I want to see emails that I received yesterday. And again, I've got 33,000 emails, 35,000. Look how fast it returned them. 268 emails received yesterday. Clear it again. I want to point out one cool feature. I have a friend that's going to love this feature when I hit the arrow for current mailbox. So you can also hit subfolders, current folder. I'm going to leave it right here. You can also add more options. I have a friend that always flags emails. It wants to search by the flag status. So flag status, apply. Now when I come up to search, Flag status is available. I only want to see emails that I've flagged for follow-up. Search. They should show up in yellow. That is a new feature, but those are the ones I had seven. I'm going to clear it in case you're wondering why they showed up in yellow. Now if you flag an item, it shows up in yellow in Outlook. If you don't have that yet, you'll have it soon. So search is very fast very reliable, huge improvement for Microsoft Outlook. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have a couple webinars coming up in September. It is August 2019. Uh, feel free to go to my website, subscribe to my website, you'll get notifications about the webinars because it's always a limited group. Thank you for your time. Have a wonderful weekend.